mouse i'm just moving it to the other pc which looks so magical actually moving this dragging and dropping it to the next pc guys today in this video i'm going to show you guys how to use a single keyboard and mouse for controlling two laptop or two computer so most of the time what happens is <clears throat> you'll be having two computers mainly if you are doing editing or you are doing stock market so one side it will be the stocks will be going there and you have to control it and many other thing whatever editing or whatever most people have to use more than one pc or two screens are required but what happens is you will have one keyboard and mouse or I can understand you know, for controlling one uh, laptop and for the other one you need to use an another one or each time you have to move around like this if it's a laptop then also it's fine but you are on pc it's too difficult to shift between both so today in this video i'm going to give you guys a solution for that today just by using a single keyboard and mouse i'm going to control both this laptops means the cursor i can move it around in both the laptops just by using this two so what you have to do is first you have to go and download an application i'll show you which application it is first go to your browser and just type there mouse without borders and the starting only you can see that it will be seen here only microsoft from microsoft itself we can download it so it's better and safe this small application you have to just download it so there's a download button start downloading now so it has start downloading and it has finished also you have to open and you have to set it up so the installation has been successful and finish it off and they will ask you the permission for running press yes so this is the application this is how the application looks like so now what i'll do is i'll go ahead and install the same application on this laptop also so i have installed the application on both the devices as you guys can see and before starting i'll show you guys one thing this keyboard and mouse only controls this laptop for the time being so you can see that i am moving the mouse it only controls this one it doesn't have any effect on this one because for controlling it i have to use the touchpad so now i'll uh, show you guys how to set it up there will be one host machine and there will be one to be connected to it so this i will use the host one because this is the one to which the keyboard is connected so what i have to do is for getting started to make it the host machine in the first machine you have to just give no to it and there they will show a security code and the computer name and now go to the next machine and there you have to give yes to it so what happens is now here they are asking for the security code and the computer name so i'll just fill it so i have filled the security code now i'll just fill the computer name as well so now you can see that i have filled both the security code and computer name so this is the same thing which is written here you should it, it is case sensitive so you have to make sure it all capital letter and small letter and all the special character should match correctly now after this i have to just go ahead and give link so after pressing it in this computer dash came success you are done almost so here also the same thing next we'll put next and see what they tells okay it has been connected now done 
and here you can see there are two computers and here also I'll just finish off the setup so here you can see there are two computers and from here what you can do is they're asking what is the physical setup means where is the computer kept that's what they're asking I mean sometimes this computer will be here here and this is a straight line configuration so if you want to have there will be four displays like this then that also you can control you can go ahead and put two row but we are having only two computers so so this is the connected computer so this is the computer which has been connected this one so this is this computer should be here so i'll just go ahead and drag it and drop it to the other side and then i'll put apply so now i should be able to move this mouse to the other one see yeah i can see that the mouse is going to the next computer from here from anywhere i just move it it is going to the other one see i'll show you See, this is the mouse. I'm just moving it to the other PC. It looks so magical actually. From here, I can just take it to the another PC. Just move it, it will go to the other one. And another thing which you can do is you can type also. See, example, I want to type something here. I can just go ahead and open the browser. See? using the same thing i can type this is connected to this one but i am able to connect this to type it on the other pc also see and the same thing just take the mouse to the other one i took it to the other one and here also i will be able to type obviously see If I want to go ahead and type to the other one, I can go ahead back. See, I can go ahead back and go there and continue the typing. So one more thing I'll uh, show you guys and I can also do one more thing. I can co copy this text uh, copy and I can even go to the other one and I can paste it here as well see go here and paste it see from the other pc i was able to paste the things here and one more thing you guys can do is that you can move the things from one laptop to the other one see i'm moving this dragging and dropping it to the next pc so what they does is they'll make a folder like this and it will be moved to that folder so i can uh, copy and paste items like this as well so that's it guys i hope you guys like the video and it is helpful so if you like the video please like and subscribe and thank you thank you so much for watching take care